Hello everyone, welcome back to Techopolis. So, uh, I've done... I don't think I've done much between episodes. Uh, ooh. I did make the multi-servos. So I made the multi-servo press. Ooh, I'm getting a bit of lag. Strange. Anyway, yeah, the multi-servo press. This one is for the aluminium plates. So I've got those up here. Uh, 51. Ooh. Lovely. Uh, this one... What goes here? That's the... That's the gears, these things, right? So I can I can chuck these in here like this. I've only got four more left to make. I don't know why I made that many, but yeah, I've got quite a lot of um, advanced technium right now, so that's pretty good. Uh, what I was going to do this episode... I have a weird plan for this. Yeah. I'm going to do a, another platform above this. I don't know if I want to make it out of the blue again. That would look that would look fine, I think. So, yeah, maybe we do do that. Uh, oh, I need some logs if we do that then. I've got five. That's not going to be enough. I've got Constantine in here as well. Oh, I do. Okay, well, let's grab that out. Some storage for this over here, so might as well use that. Yeah, all I'm doing here, by the way, is uh, this magmatic generates 40,000, no, is it 40 RF per tick? So every machine uses 20, so including the uh, multi-servo. Um, and what I have done is, so this, these redstone furnaces, I've put some of these hardened integral in there. Uh, done it with this one, done it with this one, because when, like, I think that, that doubles the speed. It does say scale factor times two, right? So that will double the speed of this. And when one of these goes into this, it then gets doubled, if you know what I mean. So because it gets doubled and it gets pushed up into this, there's two operations of this has to happen to make it turn into the uh, the ingots so I thought that would be a good ratio and plus I did put integral components in this because one of these with an integral component in it takes 40 RF and then one of these creates 40 so I needed to double it and once I doubled it I realized that this is 20 this is 20 and this is 40, so that, that's perfect right there. Absolutely perfect. So that's pretty good. Uh, but yeah, I've got, I think I've got everything kind of done now. The only thing I really need to do is maybe set one of these up again downstairs. Because there's not actually much downstairs now. If I um, If I hop down there. I don't know where I put it. I probably put it in the middle. And then where this one is here, I can have a pipe that goes, or a, not a pipe, what do we call them? Logistical transporters. I can have one of those that goes up and feeds up to like here for the obsidian. Although saying that, we've got a butt ton of obsidian now, so <laughs> we've got quite a lot. Uh, so, I think the first thing we need to do, oh, and I haven't moved this yet, I do need to do that at some point. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, this, this here should be the outside, and then I need to shave off, like, one whole thingy. And I don't, yeah, I haven't shaved off the bit that I did down here yet, but I will do that at some point. Anyway, so this episode, I'm just going to try and get this uh, this platform built up here. And then we are going to completely automate, like we've done over here. So this has been this has been generating us the technium that we needed. And we've got 19 advanced, which remember each one of these takes uh, one of these ingots as well, right? Uh, we've got 20 even. Oh, even better. 
So I can take those out and put these over here. Uh, is there any way of... I think I've probably looked this up already, but... You can just multi-servo press it. Cool. Okay, I might have to set up another multi-servo press then. Upstairs somewhere. And have that generate the basic basic play. So yeah, um, I'm just going to go make the uh, make this new platform. And uh, I'll be back in a bit. There we go. We've made ourselves a little bit of a platform and I also moved this up here and this one this pipe here goes down oh let me go down and show you I haven't actually like plugged it in yet but or, or like wrenched it this this is the funny part anyway I'll come back to that so this one here I need to undo that one and undo that one as well this one I can do this I think yeah and that will send send up this one I can do this and that will send up as well that will just put like yeah a ton of ton of stuff in there and then I can also do this one and that will push the steel up so this is the invar the Constantine gears and then if we run up here this is, I, I miscalculated a little bit. I actually wanted to build this one down. But I think it's fine like this. Because, well, I wanted it one down. So then this would be like, the face of it would be here. But would be like on the same level as this. But this is fine too. We could put a pipe instead of this. And then move this up one. But... I think, yeah, this this works as well, so might as well do this. And then if we look in here, the only thing that's missing is these basic plates. I think for now what we're going to do is we are going to do those ones manually. And the last thing is obsidian. So, I feel like I should move this whole thing. I've already I've messed about with this setup so much for the obsidian. It's crazy. Uh, but yeah, I think what we need to do next is just... I want to move down. There you go, like that. Yeah, we need to move this entire setup here. And get it to feed the obsidian. In fact, what we can do for now... Yoink the obsidian out from over here. And then we can kind of set it up over on this side. I was thinking if I plop it there like that. I've got my F7 on like at all times now, just because. We can do that and that. Now, underneath this, there is a pipe. So what we can do is this bit here will be the thing that gets fed. So it goes down like this, basically. Can I put one there? Oh, I can. And there. Nice. So, yeah, that will get fed from, I think, underneath. Underneath is probably the place we need to put it. But that means that this sort of spider thing is kind of working right now. Getting all the bits, other than the fact that it doesn't have any power. So I have got some of this basic. And I was thinking, if we stick one on top... we can feed I might make two more of these um, magmatics and it will annoy me if I don't do it on the other side like this as well so come on you know what we can just place it down like that and then get our <laughs> wrench out stop being lazy with it there we go and the last thing is we need to get lava in this so Let's do it this way around. And the last thing is pipes. So one like this, one like this. Swoosh that around like that. These don't have any upgrades in them. Ideally we'd get some upgrades in them. 
Oh, poo, this also needs... Um... How am I going to get power into this? I mean, we... Oh. That's going to look so weird, though, if I... Uh... If I move this from up here down underneath, and then I can have pipes that come up. Okay, screw it, we're gonna do it. So, if I grab this. Thank you. And then. I think I can stick it right here. And that'll fill this up with lava. Oh, this is going to be so janky looking. I think that that's the word for this, janky. Um, I have another plan. Okay, let me fall back down here. Yeah, this this will look probably weird as well, but that is fine. We can do this. And we can get rid. That's a pipe. It's not what I wanted. Issue is, all of these look very similar. So, <laughs> do this. Get rid of this one down here. To get rid of this. And then we're only going to have three. If that makes any sense whatsoever. In fact, I could have put the... Uh, the thingy here instead. And then had the pipes going around. But that is fine, because I, I can have another pipe here, right? And then I can stick this like that. There you go. That is now powered. And that is now creating us advanced technium. The only thing that is missing is the basic technium. I think we're going to call that automated. This one down here is automated. This one up here is semi-automated, let's say semi, because we still need to feed it with the basic technium plates. But yeah, there we go. I also kind of want to have some way of getting this out of here. Uh... About, uh, so let's do this. And then if we grab a draw, actually we can use this crate for now. Could put this crate right here, but then it would connect to this straight away. Okay, you know what, let's do it. And, yeah, I thought that would happen. There would be some... Is that nuggets? Why is nuggets coming up here? That's very weird. And we can do this. And there we go. We are getting the advanced technium coming into this crate for now. Beautiful. Right. What is it we need to do this episode? I think one of the plans for this episode is gonna involve well first off I need to move this but I might do that between episodes can't be bothered to do it right now <laughs> but yeah I think one of the plans should be let's get into refined storage because and if I'm honest once we've got refined storage everything is going to be so much easier and so much neater like we don't actually have to have all of these pipes everywhere we can have one pipe or one, no, it's not even a pipe, it's it's a cable, right? I have a cable on this. Or even a crafter. A crafter would be cool. And we just say, give us, make us like 10 
advanced technium. And then it would go up there. I like that idea. Okie dokie. Right, let's... Look into that. Right. First things first. Let's have a look at the quests. Uh, I've got three quests, apparently. So I've got three of those uh, tech bucks. So, advanced technium. You want us to create an ender chest. A controller we couldn't do anything with. I mean, Xnet would probably have been a pretty good idea. Like, moving stuff around, but... I mean, we've got better solutions now because of this. So printed... Oh, hello. I think... I'm not entirely sure. But I think the multi-servo press is actually slower than the metal press to begin with, right? So we can do lots of upgrades. And the upgrades will... Yeah, I think the upgrades will make this quicker. And in fact, we should probably make... Oh, I already had it up there. We should probably make another couple of these multi-servos. I think that's what we're going to need to do. What's what's it say for these ones? Electron plate turns into that. Or we could just put it through there. Okay. Um... Wait, it was in the quest. Okay, so that's also a multi-servo press. That is also a multi-servo press. Do we need these for refined storage? I'm guessing we do. We do not, by the looks of it. Yeah, I don't think we do. Okay. I'm not a big fan of when they um, lock refined storage behind the inscribers. But, fair enough. If it's in here, it's in here. Okay, right. Let's crack out a bunch of quests. I like that idea. What did I just press? Was that R? Oh, yeah. Okay, right. So, we need a... Prismarine crystal. So let's grab one of those. One of those. Um, let's let's just bookmark all of these things. Bookmark the printed silicon. Well, I made a bunch of silicon. I don't know if I. Well, I don't know why I made it at one point, but I think uh, I was thinking let's rush this rush to. The uh, uh, refined storage, but then I don't know. It's been fun, like doing. I know it's worse or automation, but it's actually like fun automation. I think, in my opinion, because it's not just you. You know, you stick a thing down. You have to think about it. You don't have to do. Well, you you have to like plan where everything's going to be and if you want it to look nice then that's how you're going to have to do it uh, let's also make all of these things even though it's applied energistics and we're not going to do applied energistics I don't believe so what is this certus quartz so let's get I don't know um Stack of that, stack of certus. What's what's the other stuff? So electrum. Oh, I need to make a bunch of electrum then. How much did I make? Oh, I've got twelve left. And I've got one. <laughs> okay, that's fine. We we can use these twelve. Uh, I, for now. Because we've got a bunch of power like stored up in this. I think it might be a good idea to use this. So let's make 12 of each. Yeah, I think 12 of each sounds about right. Sounds like a good number. Uh, does that mean I can just feed these back through and it'll be fine?
Yes. Wait, wait. Yay. Uh, do we need this silicon that I've had in my bag for ages for anything else? Oh, yeah, we do. Okay. Oh, that's that's actually pretty, pretty okay then. Ah, okay, so it's just the one case. So let's do 12 of these as well then. Yeah. So I'll pull that one out. Pull that one out as well. Nice. Okay, once this is finished, um, I'll be right back. And there we go. I realized that I needed <laughs> needed triple the amount of silicon, right? Because each of these requires a silicon. Is that how it works? I, I completely missed... Oh, okay, yeah, that is how it works. Whew. So we are going to need three redstone and then 30... 3... 33? Of the, um, oh god, what is it called? Quartz enriched. One, two, three. Oh yeah, but we need to make the inscriber first. Oh, we need two more printed. Uh, I knew that would happen. <laughs> Maybe there'd be one more reason. I, I really need to move this as well. One and two. Oh, it's nice that it's quiet though. Thank you for whoever suggested making this quiet, because yeah, that was gonna that would annoy me. I know it. Uh, we also oh, that's a point. I am gonna grab. A stack of this. A stack of this. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I forgot that. How have I not put a tank on you yet? I had to uh, quickly pause because there was a, a dog outside barking. I, I don't know who was more excited. Me, because there's a dog and I love dogs. Or the dog itself, because it was, it was going mental. Uh, what were we doing? Uh, I was running over here because reasons. Uh... Oh yeah, I was running over here so I could see if I had any. I've got loads of tech bugs. Whoa! Uh, so we're going to grab thirty-five so we can fill the smeltery up. There is one right there that we could probably nick, because this isn't. Ah, oh, sorry. We can just buy a new one. Why? Why the heck not? Uh, so this one and thank you. I'm gonna put this. I had one right here. That's what it was. <laughs> uh oh. Also, oh, it's already gone through. Oh, nice. Oh wait. Yeah, that would be why. Yeah, about that. <laughs> Take this out, put this in. So I put a stack in there, if I remember correctly. Uh, maybe I should rip this down. We're not really using it, are we? I mean, we probably... Eh, yeah, it's fine. It's fine where it is. Um... <laughs> We put a stack in there, and I think we decided it was three stacks, so one and two. One, two. So that should just go off and get us a bunch of this molten quartz, and this should make us a ton more quartz enriched. And something that I did notice, let me just do a little tidy of my inventory, so chuck these away. I don't know why I have the wool on me. Oh yeah, a creeper exploded and destroyed my bed. That's something I have been doing, and I, I used to do it quite a bit, right, is I just stick crafting tables everywhere. 
Where's this one going to go? Uh, stick it in the middle for now. Yeah. That's that's painful that this is off center. Uh, we are getting rid of these two, right? So. Uh, one thing I can do. Double power. It is using double the lava, though, isn't it? Nah, it's fine. <laughs> Absolutely fine. Uh, yeah, so now we've got this crafting table, we can make one of these inscribers. Oh, yeah, so... One, and two, and... I think this is... This is this one, right? Yeah. Now we can make the inscriber. Yay! This... Does this require... I think this requires power. We just got a power cable light sort oh we've got one right here. Why is there a thingy in this pulverizer? That probably shouldn't be a thing. Did I end up putting one in here? Oh it did. <gasps> and the backlog's gone. No way. Okay, let's um Amazing. Sweet. So this is now feeding this. Exactly what we wanted to see. Anyway, what were we doing? Uh, this needs a power augment. And then we can stick that on there. One like this, one like this, one like this. That's how you make them. Yay. Yay. And then I think it's just the same, right? But with each of the, the different circuits yeah at refined storage oh. oh I love this version as well because in this version you don't have all the different like dyed versions of this press U on the item to view the recipes and then it shows you how to dye them I always like kind of annoyed me that there was like all the different dyed versions of these, and that has come back I think in the latest version. Bit of a bit of a shame, but ah, it's not too bad, is it? So the controller, uh, if I remember correctly, we need three of these. Is there the better inscriber as well? Because uh, yeah, I think it was Cuboid Outpost that we played, where I had a really cool, like, extra inscriber thingy. Okay, so that'll get us that. Then we need... Crafting Grid, which takes another one. Well, uh, yeah, that's the one that we've looked at. These two are iron ones. So we need two gold, two iron. And then what is it for the thing that holds the discs? That disc drive, there you go. Oh, that's just a diamond one as well. Okay, so we just need one of these, one of these, one of these. And then another set of, Oh, that's a point. Have they changed the recipe for... They have. Kind of knew that was going to that was gonna happen. Okay, how do we make this stuff? Whoa. Molten glass... Oof. Okay, so molten glass and then ruby, sapphire, platinum. Platinum we haven't even set up yet. Brilliant. Silver, quartz, certus quartz, and these have to be in. All of these have to be in dust form. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. That's how you make feral flare lanterns. Ah. I'd love to make a few of these because yeah, look at all the torches we've got. You can just get rid of them once I've made feral flares. Uh, these are all sided as well, aren't they? There's one underneath as well. So what I could do is that's a point. 
once we get into refined storage, I can easily... Oh, yeah, I need to do... Is it this one? Yeah, it is that. Yeah, once we get into refined storage, I can easily automate this. Um, I've shown it in a few of my series before, but... Yeah, I'm going to use a draw controller and, yeah, a crafter from... Oh, that's a point. What's the crafter situation like? <laughs> uh, where is the crafter? Crafter? Oh, there it is. And you do have the extra storage mod. Oh, thank God, because I, I really, really, really like using this mod. Blocks of gold, blocks of diamonds, blocks of netherite. And I never looked up how you make netherite. Ah, there you go. There's ancient debris clumps. Ancient debris. There you go. Ancient debris ore. Okay. Ancient debris ore, which I think is this. No? Oh, it must mean this, right? Yeah, yeah, by the looks of it, it means this. That's cool. Which is I? Ugh. Okay. Okay, then. So, we need to set up. So, we got this one. We do need to set the platinum one up. Oh, that's fine, actually, because the thing that we were missing was the uh, advanced technium. So, uh, where is the platinum? <laughs> platinum uh, it is so diamond is the elite one so we can make that soon hopefully we've got the gold we've got lead it's this one boosh right okay so we need to rip this down because I want to put it over in this corner because then it will match Ooh, yeah careful <laughs> It will match, um, you know, this one, this one, and this one. So, yeah, I do kind of want to put it in this corner. How is this doing? Okay, the smart read's done. Are you done as well? You are. Okay, I'm going to rip this down. Back in a sec. And it's gone. Uh, yeah, so I need to probably get rid of a bunch of the stuff in my inventory again. Uh, yeah, I can just chuck stuff in here for now, right? Oh, actually, this is... I already had this one sort of designated for that sort of stuff. And I could do that as well. Soon enough, we can do the awesome... You know, you know when you close all your tabs... Uh, after like a big project or something. We can have an awesome feeling of that with refined storage. So I think what we're going to try and do is get an, uh, get a refined storage system set up this episode. Uh, I know we're actually quite far into this episode, right? Because it's... Okay, maybe next episode we'll do that. I'll set this up, this platinum. Uh, so I have a miner. What else do I need for the miner? So just some bronze. We've got bronze over here. Oh, I have no food. Movie magic, I have all my food back. <laughs> uh, why are you not pulling out of there? Stone, what are you doing? I can make you go a bit quicker. Are you still filling this up? Even though this has got nowhere to go. Interesting. This is quite slow. Uh, is there any good way of making stone? I mean, I could upgrade the miner. That might be a good idea. Ooh, yeah. I don't know how quick that makes this. That is a good point, actually. I've got a cobblestone... Yeah, I've got a... Um... Cobble gen down here, haven't I? How's this one doing? Yeah, 
yeah, we could put that in our jumbo furnace over there. Smelts a stack at a time, right? So we could get like a bunch. I'm not going to worry about it, if I'm honest, because, yeah, it just means we can steal this six that we've got right here. And I had some... Okay, what is it for the upgraded version? That is fine. We can go get our steel over here. And I did put this down. That was a spider. What the heck are you doing here? I'm not going to say no to some string, but have I not got F7 on? That reminds me, yeah, I do need to do the uh, obsidian downstairs. Anyway, I, he probably jumped from somewhere. Uh, I don't know why he came back over here. We don't actually need to be over here to do this, but oh well. <laughs> So we do one of those, and in my bag I've got these two. Boosh. And this, I think, generates us platinum and osmium. So, and osmium is going to be really good for us, right? Is this one one away? It is one away. Cool. And there we go. And now we just need to put this on top. We are probably going to need another way up again over over this side at some point. Maybe we do everything on the surface for this side. That would work, wouldn't it? Oh god, this is so slow. If we power these... That's an osmium cluster, That's that's fine. So this one here, we could do with two pulverizers and two redstone furnaces. And then this one needs one pulverizer and a redstone furnace. And then this one needs two as well, right? So platinum. Ah, wait a minute. We do just need the dust, right? We don't technically need the ingots. So we could just have a pulverizer on this, and that will make us the dust. Yeah, there we go. There's our juicy platinum right there. Yeah, okay. Anyway, right. Anyway, I think that's all we've got time for this episode, unfortunately. I, I feel like we got a good amount done. We started on refined storage. Hopefully next episode we'll get a refined storage system set up. That'd be really cool. I'm also going to litter this place with feral flare lanterns so I don't have to think about the uh, uh, the torches being everywhere. Look at look at down here. Just scattered. Scattered everywhere. Whoa. Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thanks for joining. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.